Okay, we're back. Hopefully we're gonna solve this case right now. So let's do this. Go to our evidence computer. Events of killer. Let's analyze this. Aha! Uh -huh. The buttons on the victim's clothes, huh? Yes. I'll look into them right away. One Hurry more, up. please. Uh, hopefully this will help us find the identity of our mystery murderer. Uh -huh. Dr. Kimishima, it was there. I found it. There's a fingerprint from someone who isn't the victim. It's uh, a right <gasps> thumb. Great. Run the print through the list of registered offenders immediately. Leave it to me. Do it. Such an attention to detail has gone into this. It can't possibly be a first-time offender. There has to be a match for this fingerprint in our records. I sincerely hope so. This case should be over soon. Solid evidence. Killer's fingerprint. We got you. Ooh. Conclusion reached. We solved the case. Time for a cinematic. The dead shall speak. Let's put together the truth of what happened here. The victim in this case is 30-year-old Dennis Taylor. As there's no motive for murder, it's a suspected suicide. However, the victim had a hidden other side. This card is the one with proof of that. Okay. The side of the victim that had been hidden in this case was... Dennis the Pusher. Yes. While he did work at the bar, he also dealt drugs. This case is related to the victim's drug activities. The proof of that is on this card. Evidence proving that drugs were the motive for murder. Missing drugs. Indeed. The drugs hidden behind the shelf were missing. The killer went into Taylor's room to kill him for his drugs. The real cause of the victim's death can tell us that. I know that because of this card. True cause of death was... Yes. Right. The wound on the wrist was not the true cause. Next, the killer disguised the murder as a suicide. This is true. This card proves the misdirection used to hide the murder. The evidence proving that steps have been taken to camouflage the body is... Yes, the appearance of suicide covered up the real cause. The next yeah, topic is the secret hidden in the room that. itself. The murderer used a trick to create a locked room mystery. It was made to seem as if the victim was the only one there. This card shows the trick that had been used. The locked room trick. <laughs> exactly. The killer thought this would clear his trail. But he was wrong. And yet, the culprit had one more way to hide from suspicion. That was to hide when the murder itself took place. This card shows how he went about that ruse. Hmm. Secret of the fire. The murder took place three hours prior to the fire start. It's natural to assume that if the room was locked, then the crime and the fire would be at the same time. The plan was perfect. No fingerprints were left in the room. However, there was one thing the killer hadn't counted on. There was one task he needed to remove his gloves to do. 
This card is evidence of that task. The buttons on the shirt. He probably couldn't button the clothes with his gloves on. No matter how small the buttons, they were still prints. Even a fragment of a fingerprint can be used to identify him. The victim must have been surprised. After all, he thought the killer was a customer. This is what he said at the very end. Final flickers of this soul's light show me the truth. It was the electrician. It was you. <gasps> Who's there? Huh. I'm sorry. It was I must the electrician. have surprised what? you. Why are you smiling like that? You're that electrician. Why are you here? Oh, um. I was called up because a switchboard blew. What? No. I need to have it fixed by tomorrow. I see. That sounds difficult. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> he tried to stab her with a screwdriver. Freeze. <laughs> Don't move. Don't, Don't smile. Move. I see corpses all day. One more won't bother me. And the cops are already on their way somehow. How convenient. Dude, she almost died. Jeez. How do you get into the house anyway? How do you know he's, she just solved the case? So many questions. Uh, Naomi! Are you hurt? I'm sorry. I should have stayed. Yeah, you should have. I've solved the badass. case. I'll give you my report tomorrow. The report can wait. Naomi, you must think of your safety. Safe what? Huh. Nobody lives forever. Even if I died today, it'd just be earlier than I expected. Pretty dark. Well, we finally finished that after like three episodes. So I guess we'll just end it off here, give it a short video. Thanks for watching. We'll continue next time on Let's Play Trauma Team. Later.